with a simple message on today and yes the message is simple and sweet but don't I always have it simple and sweet for y'all yes I do now as I was taking my beautiful stroll into the beauties of the beautifulness of the beauties I realized that my feet are my feet I also realized that my hands is my hands and my ears is my ears. My nose is my nose and my eyes is my eyes. My breasts are my breasts and my gigantor booty is my gigantor booty. My yoni is my yoni. My knees are my knees. My thighs are my thighs and my calves are my calves. My ankles are my ankles and my toes are my toes. My fingernails are my fingernails and my toenails are my toenails. Two ear holes, they're mine as well as my nostril nose holes. My teeth is my teeth and my tongue is my tongue. My lips are my lips. My eyelashes or eyebrows are my eyebrows and eyelashes are my eyelashes. My hair is my... Y'all get the point, don't you? <laughs> like, okay... My back is my... Okay, all right. I think y'all get the point now. All those things in which I just named, they all play a part to make a body. Right? Yes. Oh, my stomach getting jealous. My stomach is my stomach. <laughs> They all play a part in the body, in making a body whole. My hands can't say, hey, I want to be the butt today. Because who's going to play the hands? The butt wants to be the butt. My eyes can't say, can I walk on, can I be the feet today? You think I can be the feet? No, you eyes. You gon' get smashed if you go down there. Because the feet is the feet. And I can't walk on my feet through my eyes. Get the picture? Unless you some type of transmutation alien beach that I don't know about. Then your type. I don't really know what to say. The point in which I'm trying to say right now <laughs> play your part. Be who you are. In the beginning of this, I named the goddesses, the gods, emperors. it even says that everybody has to play their part the body plays its part your hands got you you have to be who you are you cannot be something else and that's even if you have to step into your destiny 
of divine truth and divine self and divine path and divine who you are. What's in your heart? The heart can't say, oh, I want to be the brain today. Or the heart can't say, I want to be the stomach today. Or the heart can't, the heart is the heart. you want to be heartless the teeth can't say oh could you put some uh, fingernails on me could that, could it be the, can I be the fingernails the breast can't be like oh can it, you think I can be your knees <laughs> can I be your feet no the breast have to be the breast I gotta be the breast. I gotta be able to do this. And I can't do this to no knees. <laughs> that's, on, that's too hard. Shit. That's how I like cancer. <laughs> we look at other people and we like, I wanna be that. But you don't know all that that even went through to get where they at. You think that it's easy. Nothing in life is easy. Anything that easy, you shouldn't even want. You not gonna want for too long. You gonna toss it like children do when they get toys, when they get toys after toys after toys. For example, you see, my children didn't get a lot of toys. I didn't buy my children a lot of toys. First of all, they were getting toys. And then my my girls wasn't really a toy girl. They're more of movies girls and... Uh, Maybe a little paint and nails here and there doing nails. Um, they ain't really playing too much hair. I even bought them mannequin dolls. They didn't do all of that. They just, they have an imagination, I should say. But stepping outside of that, when I finally got to see other children and how their parents or parents raised them, for instance, like my son's brother, half brother, brother, half brother, shit, I don't know the terms nowadays, I just noticed how he would have a shitload of toys, shitload of toys, y'all, I mean, you wouldn't believe he had a toy tower, I promise you, every day, faithfully, I, I see his father, my son's father, buy him a toy, every day, I swear to God, no cap, I'm like, damn, like, and he'll be like, fuck this toy and move on to the next toy. And then the next day, he'll be like, fuck that toy, move on to the next toy. It kind of even put me in the mind of how, like, people handle relationships, too. They get something new, and they like, fuck that. They don't care how valuable that one is. They don't care if, if a person spent their last to get it. They don't care they just I'm telling you but you know what out of all those toys he picked the older toys <laughs> he will always pick the older toy the toy that show him more value and it was just one but he had a toy tower I swear to god y'all I swear to god I don't even know how many toys he had at his granny's house of the matter is why did I even go to that value toys give it to me spirit being who you are the heart be who you are I don't even know why I went to that I probably gotta recap and go with can't stand for getting my points. But every day we should be pushing forward to be who we are and not who somebody else is or wanting they gifts because you don't know what the hell they had to do to get where they are. And that's just period. You don't know. Teach your children value. Teach your children the value of things. Teach them these things. 
no way they should feel obligated. I love the children. I really do. And partially the way they are is because the parents are the way that they are. And I think I said this last week, y'all. Give your children something to where you are dead and gone. Well, energy lives forever. But when you have to transition they have something that can carry them throughout this life that you didn't have and it's bigger than money morals respect boundaries be who you are without hurting others purposely